Hello friends, welcome back to the Global Studio YouTube channel. In this video, we will learn how to replace a model in drawing to create a multiple drawings in a single step without actually creating them from scratch. So watch the video completely to learn this important trick. First, you have to create two models with similar features but different sizes. Then take one of the model and create a drawing for that. To create the drawing, go to file, click on new and select metric. I selected metrics because my model is in metric units. Under the drawing tab, select the ANSI mm.idw option and finish the step by clicking on create. Right click on sheet 1 and change the sheet size to A3. You can change the sheet size according to your requirement. Select the base view option and create the front view and side view like this. After finishing this step, provide all the dimensions that I am just mentioning here. Finally, save the file in the required folder. This is the first step and now it's time to create a drawing for the other model. Go to manage tab and under this tab select the replace model reference option. Click on the file name and browse the folder to replace the model in the drawing. I hope everybody can see the changes now and also we can see all the dimensions and reference lines updated accordingly in the newly replaced model. Adjust the dimensions if necessary before saving the drawing. Now we will learn how to save the file properly in the folder. If you directly save the file, the old drawing will be lost and replaced with the new drawing. To avoid this problem, take the save as option and it will create a new drawing file for the newly replaced model. Then browse the folder to save the file. This is how you can create a huge number of drawings for standard parts in a simple way. Screws, nuts, shafts, bearings are few examples where you can use this method because the features of the parts are similar and only the sizes are different. You can also try with models having one or more additional features and later you can give the dimension for those additional features. This way you can improve efficiency in drawing creation. I bet you will see a 100% increase in your efficiency. I hope this tutorial is helpful and clear for everyone. Thank you for watching. We will meet again in the next video. Bye bye.